And now I would like to introduce you a wonderful singer, Denise Lee Chita. In He's So Good. Come on! For years, Denise Chitea kept her talents within the four walls of her church. New Jerusalem Church of God in Belgium, where she and her husband, Bishop Jean Chitea, are pastors. Denise decided to step out in faith and share her gift with the world, releasing two CD projects. She was at the top of her game when tragedy struck. I remember the last Sunday I sung in the church. It was powerful. And uh, I had written a, a song. It was a new song for the choir. And it was powerful. I'm telling you, the whole church, we were praising God so strongly. But I told to my husband after the service, I wasn't praising. I was in warfare. I was in a battle. And two days after, I, I, I felt something wrong with my leg. I, I, I was, it was hard for me to, to do one step and another. Denise went to the hospital where doctors ran a series of tests. The news was not good. It was the whole body who was affected. It, it's about being paralyzed, in fact. He tried to explain me, you know, you have to forget now the life that you have had till now and you won't be able to do everything that you, 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 you get used to do. It's going to be a new way of living. So, and it's funny because while he was ex trying to explain me what was happening, I just left my head and I asked him, tell me, would I be still able to sing? He looked at me and said, what? He, said, he told me, lady, I don't know if you understand what I'm talking about. And you asked me if you could sing. I said, yes, I want to know if I will still be able to sing, even if I own my bed or what, but I, I have to, to praise my God. I want to know if I will be able to sing. So uh, 10 days after I left the hospital in a wheelchair and uh, we went home, the doctor told my husband, we, we can do nothing for her. We can do nothing for her. Uh, normally, she will end like a vegetable. However, Denise and her husband refused to believe the doctor's report and began to pray. The Lord spoke to Bishop Jean, promising Denise would be healed. We didn't know when. We didn't know how. <laughs> but we knew that I would be restored. And the Lord did it. It took time. You know, it was not an instant uh, healing, but it was restoration, restoration. And I think it was restoration just because I had so much stuff to learn throughout all this. And people, even people around me had so much stuff to learn. You know, sometimes you think, yes, now I know how to praise God throughout every situation, but something reminds you that no, you're not ready to praise him in every circumstances. So he knows when you endure something, oh no, the Lord doesn't sleep. He's there. He's in control. He's with you. <laughs> He's there. And so when you were on your bed and when you couldn't move, what was your conversations with God? I'm telling you that he used that time to give me so much revelations. That's why I'm telling you that now my values have changed. And it's amazing, but one of the things he learned me is that the devil has no power. Amazing. <laughs> You're not really able to move, but he's showing you that the devil has no power. He showed me the protection. He spiritually showed me the protection that is around the real children of God. I said, Lord, it's like that. So it's in our interest to fear God, to follow His will, to search for His glory in our lives. He's God anyway, <laughs> but it's for you. If you have to follow Christ, it's just for you to live in your victory, to live in His protection, to live in His love, to live in His promises. During Denise's time of illness, she wrote several songs, which turned into her first English CD titled, 
everything is possible. My strong tower. When people hear everything is possible, what do you want them to get out of the CD? I want people to be happy. May the joy of the Lord be their strength. Because that joy doesn't depend on circumstances. The joy doesn't depend if you are if you feel good in your body, if your children is at home or not. No, this joy must depend on the fact that you have Jesus in your life. And you have Jesus, he's in control. He's in control. That's the message of this city.